the critical need for a vaccine. Tonight, one of the most promising trials in the world is actually being done right here in the Bay Area. Stanford doctors started the phase three trial of the Johnson & Johnson vaccine today to figure out if it is effective. NBC Barry's Ian Cull spoke with a doctor leading the effort and one of the people getting vaccinated. New video shows the first injection for a COVID-19 vaccine trial at Stanford. It's the Johnson & Johnson sponsored study. Dr. Philip Grant is the principal investigator. You know, I do other clinical studies as well, but it's nice to be, uh, be helping out, uh, getting something that hopefully will be available in the springtime sometime. This phase three trial will be done at 180 sites around the world with 60,000 participants. They'll do 1,000 at Stanford. It's a double blind study, so some will get active vaccine, others will get a placebo, and they will all be monitored. And hopefully it'll prevent both total number of infections as well as number of severe infections. The vaccine essentially uses a common cold virus to deliver coronavirus genetic material into the body. The goal is to spark an immune response. They wouldn't be, you know, administering this to 60,000 people if there wasn't a level of confidence in what they're doing. Stanford graduate and aspiring physician Walter Soba got the Bay Area's first dose this morning. If there's any way that, you know, me volunteering to participate in this can be of service to the rest of our community, both locally and globally, I'm very happy to, to be involved in that. There are now four vaccines in critical stage three human trials in the country. Johnson & Johnson's was briefly on hold after a participant got sick. AstraZeneca's was also paused for the same reason, but both trials have resumed. In fact, this week, researchers in the AstraZeneca trial with Oxford say their vaccine has shown to have a strong immune response in elderly people. And Moderna says by the end of this year, it expects to have approximately 20 million doses ready to ship in the U.S., though it's still in stage three. Dr. Anthony Fauci says we should know more in weeks. The projections that we have that I think and I hope will be reasonably accurate, that we will know sometime in December whether or not we have a safe and effective vaccine. And practically speaking, when will we, we be able to deploy that vaccine? People in the Stanford trial will take a phone survey every week to see if they have symptoms. Dr. Grant says they still need more volunteers. Right now we're doing the young, healthy individuals and older, healthy individuals. And if you don't fit in that category, uh, we will later call you once we've moved on uh, to the people with chronic conditions. Each will be monitored periodically over two years, but the data on if it works will come much sooner. Ian Cole, NBC Bay Area News.